All right, we're doing the countdown on the things men can do to prevent gender violence. One thing you can do, men, uh, don't get married or don't date a chick who isn't, you know, soft-spoken and agreeable. Because then you can help at least prevent it from coming on you. Anyway, number four on our top ten list. Oh, if you suspect, because he's talking to men, if you suspect that a woman close to you is being abused or has been sexually assaulted, gently ask if you can help. Okay, if feminists don't even want the men to open up a door for them, because what does that mean? I can't do it. How is it that they want a man swooping into their relationship saying, hey, are you abused and what can I do? And that is a contradiction. Now, it's not a bad way to live. I think, yeah, duh. I mean, if you know somebody and you think they might be in any kind of precarious situation or you worry for them in any way, regardless of gender violence, whatever it is, you know, maybe they're in financial problems, whatever their problems are. Sure, as a decent human being, you would say to them without imposing and without, you know, being condescending, like, hey, let me know if there's anything I can do. That's just general human decency. But the fact that he's putting it in with, you know, suspecting somebody is being assaulted or what have you. Do you specify a woman? Yeah, woman. Uh -huh. Because they're the only ones that can be assaulted, right? I know it's not true. Case is the first video you've ever seen of mine. I know it's not true. And it's actually more likely that the woman is going to assault the man. I know. I can hear things I say and I can literally feel a disturbance in the force with all the feminists just Ugh! It makes me happy. As long as they can't find me. <laughs> so yeah. So guys, once again, you're damned if you do and you're damned if you don't. You help, you're patronizing, you don't believe she's strong, you don't help, you're an asshole and you don't care about women, etc. Jeez, I would, goodness gracious, I wouldn't want to change places with you guys. All right, stay tuned for number five.